Hey guys, here's here, and I use Final Cut Pro 10 to edit my videos, as an increasing amount of people do. It's a good solution for Max. And as you can imagine, I spend a lot of time editing my videos, a lot of hours every month editing videos, and it's important to me to be as productive as I can so I don't waste time and be doing things that I don't need to be doing. And no matter what software you use, you're probably going to be wanting the same thing. And I've got a great solution for that. This is the Editor's Keys Final Cut Pro keyboard cover, also available for Adobe Premiere and a couple other programs. Essentially, it's just a silicone cover that works with US, UK, and European Mac keyboards, whether it be a notebook or Apple's wireless keyboard. And put simply, it shows a whole bunch of keyboard shortcuts. The keys are color coordinated to show if it requires a multi button press, such as with the dark pink command button in the number row. Now, I'm not a huge fan of having a cover on my keyboard even if it does protect from oils or dirt or liquids, because it does take away a bit of the typing experience. Not a ton, and within a few days you will kind of adapt to it and it'll feel more natural and you'll break it in, but I still prefer typing on a normal naked keyboard. But at the end of the day, this is a keyboard cover that allows you to learn the ins and outs of your editing software, to learn shortcuts, to adapt to your editing software, and it will even show you some new shortcuts that you didn't know before and it will help you to memorize them, as well as keeping your keyboard clean. So it's a really cool solution if you're new to a software or you're just really interested in learning and memorizing new shortcuts, as well as, as I said, protecting your keyboard. So if you want to check this out, I'll leave a link to it in the description. Uh, it's a pretty cool little product that I have enjoyed, and I have learned a few new shortcuts while using this. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure to give it a thumbs up, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.